tabs. I don't know why. It's like a bad habit for me. Maybe that's why, because it's real loud. Oh, we're starting with Monster Hunter. Oh, I said you can keep giving me money. <laughs> you don't have to, though. I appreciate it. Charizard. It's bad Spyro. Whoa, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. This is an expansion? Ooh, that's exciting. Summer, that's so far, that's literally so far away. <laughs> Holy cow, that's like a year. What am I supposed to do till then? Massive expansion. Hey, that's really cool. What a good opener. Also, didn't they lied. They said that this was gonna be focused on Christmas Hello, stuff. Hello everyone, I'm Yoshiaki Koizumi, and I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. I like how the alerts just go up versus face. What you just saw was the first trailer for Monster Hunter Rise, Sunbreak, the massive expansion for Monster Hunter Rise. Hmm. We'll find out in the next 45, 40 Our minutes if there'll be Capcom Pokemon News Blueberry. Many new Probably though. That will enhance the experience for players of Monster Hunter Steel, Rise. thank you for 10 gifted including subs. Including new stories, locales, monsters. I appreciate it. Although not touched on in the trailer, new hunting actions Nintendo never lies, Nintendo always lies. <laughs> Monster the duality of Twitch chat summer. right there. <laughs> is scheduled to release as paid DLC in summer 2022. Please stay tuned for more information in the future. For real. All right. Let's see our first batch of Nintendo Switch headlines. Thank you, mods, for updating the command. Party during the day. I don't want to party. At night. It's almost time to party in the Mario Party Superstars game. Along with Spaceland and Peach's birthday cake, several other Space boards Land's make rad. their return. Take a stroll around Woody Woods. What's up, watch out for those Monty Moles. Um, Woody Woods They'll is an okay board, I guess. When you least expect it. Travel between two islands and Yoshi's Tropical Island. Ah, this one's pretty Fred's good too. Got the star, but she might swap places with Bowser at the last second. This is was this one Mario Party, Party 2, I think. Day and night. This is Mario Party Horror 3. Land. That King Boo Horror Land is awesome. Harmless during the day. That was 4. But at night, it'll swipe is stars. Horror Land is 3, right? Players. Or maybe Horror Land is 2. Break from I can't remember. Head to Mount Mini Games and play in mini game only courses. Compete against players worldwide for the longest win streak in survival. I can't believe they're only doing five boards. I'm so mad about this though. Multiplayer tag match. Colin, thanks for the reset. Will have seven courses available. Seven. All boards and mini games support online play. So invite family. Wait, did friends, they up it? And frenemies, and get ready for the. I party don't like the word friend frenemies. Mario Party Superstars launches on the Nintendo that's Switch this? system. Well, oh wait, that's not October yet. <laughs> Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. <laughs> this is bad timing for me. I think I'm moving that day. A new RPG is in the cards. Yu-Gi-Oh! Heart of the Cards? Welcome to Voice of Cards. Oh, that's this one game. They showed this before. Is this DM DMCA? <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh! too. <laughs> Winged Freedom, thanks for 23 months of sub, and I appreciate it. Thank you. At the Queen's behest, you'll set off. Oh, a they did not show this before. To slay a fearsome dragon for honor and fortune. What is Everything this? in this realm is represented as cards, from the protagonists to shops, towns. And they show some card shooting game last time. Take on tabletop RPGs. This seems actually okay. Square off in turn-based card battles, where your skills and a little bit of luck will determine the victor. I play Pokemon. I know what luck is. Non-existent. Why did like card video games get real big recently? From the creative minds of Yoko Taro. And Yosuke Saito is a my goodness Lee. Fold. Thank you for five gifted. I already know everyone who's watching the YouTube version of this, which I forgot to hit record, so now I got to download the vibe. Voice of Cards is gonna yell at me Isle that Dragon Roars launches on Nintendo Switch There's October 28th. Sub Pre things popping and a free up. Free demo will be available today on Nintendo eShop. Non-sanctioned. <laughs> Become a hero or an absolute disaster of a human being. 
you awaken in a hotel room in the city of Revishal, devoid of your memories. I'm already a disaster. Soon, this looks... you learn that you're a detective and get entangled in a strange murder case. Lee, thank you for five gifted. That's so nice of you. Adventure, Disco Elysium, the final cut. As you interrogate people and uncover clues, internal dialogues will begin. To investigate, you'll need the help of the 24 skills living within you. Your behavior Wait, does this game already exist? Will change depending on is this on something else already? Skills, directly impacting how the story progresses. Oh, yeah, it is. So it's just coming to Switch. It's on PC? Oh, okay, okay. What sort of detective will you become? A bad Disco one. Disco Elysium, the final cut, launches digitally on Nintendo Switch October 12th. The physical version of the game oh, will launch early 2022. Oh, I missed the name. There it is. Got it. Pre-orders for the digital... Chat, thanks for the scam train. I appreciate it. Thanks for wasting money on me. Jeez, 50 subs? You guys are unreal. Thank you so much. Holy cow, I didn't realize begin that. today on Nintendo eShop. Oh, they said available Uncover today. more stories in Hyrule Warriors oh. Age of Calamity. You know what I don't care about? Age of Calamity. I don't want any calamity. Here comes the YouTube comments and we're like, this guy doesn't like Zelda. Look, I like Breath of the Wild. I just don't like Hyrule Warriors or whatever that is. <laughs> I just don't want to smash the A button over and over again. And about that courageous friend of yours, it seems I owe him as well. Yeah. The king of Hyrule must not fall! You know, you're pretty good for a little kid. We'd better partner up on this, don't you think? I barely remember the bird people they in Breath fall. of the Wild. Is the little egg supposed to be like Baby Yoda? We're supposed to care about that? <laughs> Kinda. Behold my power! Take that! What is this? Time for the show. Oh, this is the actual gameplay of just smashing the A button. Wave 2. Are they gonna show Smash? I don't care about that either, unless it's a Pokemon. Set Chocobo. I'm into this. I don't know what this is, but I'm all in. I'm all in. Get set for a new racing experience. I'm super into this. Holy cow. Familiar Final Fantasy characters like Chocobo and Gilgamesh to be the first. The Chocobo's on roller skates. Edge out the competition by using drift boost to cut corners. Heck yeah. Magical stones called magicites are contained inside items. It's called item boxes. It's fine. You're ripping off Mario Kart. You don't have to sugarcoat it. To blast away opponents. Acquire magicites of the same element to cast even more powerful spells. Has Final Fantasy never done a kart racer? It took him this long? Each racer also has a special ability. Use it at the right time to turn the tables. Who is that? Engine customization options will be Shiro available. Shiroma? Well I don't know who that is. Online multiplayer. Can I be the dude from 15? Up to 64 players can compete Can't in remember a his name. style tournament <laughs> to determine the racing champion. He's cool, though. Chocobo GP races exclusively mm. onto Nintendo Switch next year. They had multiple Chocobo racing games? Oh, they had it. Oh, there was a PS1 game. Before we show you our next video. For sure, Steel. Yeah, yeah. We have some news about the last fighter for the Super oh. Smash Brothers Ultimate Is it a Pokemon? Game. Wait, did they say that was 64 people in a race? Mr. Sakurai, the game's director, will reveal this fighter in the final Mr. Sakurai Presents video on October 5th. Ugh. I don't care. I just want to know if it's a Pokemon or not. He'll also show you how to use this fighter. So probably going to be Cinderace, right? If they're picking a Pokemon at this point, they're picking since Cinderace. The game was released. This will be the last presentation about Super Smash Bros. <laughs> an announcement for an announcement. I hope you'll check it out. <laughs> it's or bust. Cinderace now, is uh, Cinderace isn't in the game. Uh, Incineroar was the last like new Pokemon they added, I think. Right? Wait, what is this? Last of Us? Oh, you know it could be Waluigi, right? Is that the bit like the ultimate troll? Is they saved Waluigi for last? This is not Kirby. There's not enough yarn. 
Pikmin? It 100% is? Yoshi's Island? Wait, didn't they say these games were supposed to come out in the winter? Oh, it is Kirby. You guys were right. <laughs> Twitch chat, why are you always being right? I don't like it. It was leaked. This is Mario Odyssey 2. Oh, this looks cool. Oh, is that a dog? I think it's a raccoon. I'm not sure what that was. <laughs> Breath of Kirby. Open world Kirby, finally! I can go anywhere I want. How oh, the tree textures, though. Cool. Well, that looks cool. We're showing a lot of games. We're only like 12 minutes in. Whoa, that was really cool. Also, this music is so loud, holy cow. Jeez, Kirby. Blowing my ears out. Spring? Man, why is Nintendo lying? The same, the <laughs> None of this Kirby is winter. <laughs> In this new game, you can freely move around in 3D areas using familiar Kirby moves. The setting also appears to be mysterious, filled with abandoned structures from a past civilization. Gosh, this actually looks pretty cool. What lies in store for Kirby? You think it's like that one game where you beat the monkey and then the monkey comes back with another head? We hope you'll look forward Can't remember to Kirby's what game that was. Sekiro, <laughs> Sekiro, I think. Next, we have this to show you. Please take a look. Oh, they they remembered Animal Crossing was a game. Oh, the ruse! Look, you, you this ship has sailed, Nintendo. You're a year late on this. I already sold my land to a swamp because I lived in Florida. Since its launch in 2020, the Animal Crossing New Horizons game has been enjoyed so by ago. new players around the world. New free content will arrive in November. Time to start a new island? In preparation mm. for its release, we will be airing an Animal Crossing New Horizons Direct in October. <laughs> in announcement it, we'll for an announcement. It depends details. on how big a... The problem is I probably just won't have time between moon, move, Please be on the moving for the air date of this presentation. Diamond and Pearl. Let's move on to more Nintendo Switch headlines. It still doesn't fix the problem of like, if they fix the problem where animals actually do games, something instead of just existing and, and saying the five, same five things over and over, I'd consider more. it, but that's still my biggest problem more with that game. More free content is coming to the Mario Golf Super Rush game. <laughs> this is Moon. Koopa Troopa enters the fairway as a playable character. Brilliant Moon and Shining Moon. Dish out tricky shots and dashes to mess with the competition. Thank you, Zero. It's not a haircut. I Ninja just did my hair. There's a difference. I just actually put Take product in my hair. Take advantage of blinding speed to outpace opponents. Two courses are also being added. This game seems so cool and I never played These it. These additions will come swinging in as a free software update later today. What's oh, this? Whatever this is, I An don't invitation. care. This is Kingdom Hearts You're 17. You're invited to live in a magical world with Mickey Mouse and dozens of Disney characters. Spend time with Disney friends. Craft your own whimsical costumes and furniture. And explore delightful Tree. Disney themed worlds. Thanks for the T1 sub. All, All I had to content say is I didn't like Disney. The original Nintendo 3DS version is included. Disney Magical World Thank you for the sub. 2 Enchanted I appreciate it. Edition. Source I think this is a 3DS. <laughs> 
<laughs> I know Steel loves this. A beloved Nana, she Star does. Wars game is coming to Nintendo Switch. Blast off to captivating planets and join forces Fog. with Jedi, droids. Isn't this and like a PS2 game? This blend of action, role playing, and adventure. Will you use the Force for good, or will you be lured to the dark side? Your choice it was an Xbox? Oh, Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. <laughs> launching on Nintendo Switch. Original November. Xbox. Pre-orders begin today. It was on PC on too. Nintendo okay, okay. There's one thing you must always remember. Stay human. This is the city. Humanity's last stronghold against a virus that turns people into the undead. This is already a game. In the cloud version of Dying Light 2, Stay Human, you'll need oh. to master both parkour and tactical combat Finally. to survive in this brutal I've been waiting for a game to let me do parkour. RPG. Explore alone or with up to three other players in online co op as you unravel the dark secrets. You're not a true human if you don't appreciate parkour. The then plunder the layers of the infected at night. Your decisions will shape the story but they'll also have consequences. No matter where your actions lead you, there's one thing you must always remember. I got zero Stay interest human. in this <laughs> While you're at it, take the prequel on the go in Dying Light Platinum Edition. Scavenge for supplies, craft weapons, and face hordes of the infected in a post-apocalyptic open world. Dying Light 2 Stay Human Cloud Version launches on Nintendo Switch February 4th, 2022. A free demo will also launch the same Man, day. Man, I can't get over Nintendo that Monster Hunter announcement. That Dying one was sweet. Light, Platinum Edition comes to Nintendo Switch October. A summer 19th. of next year, where all Pre the Pokemon hype will be dead. On we'll just play more Monster Hunter. Utility, morality, or liberty. In Triangle Strategy, uh, of War presented in I don't want your HBTD. salt game. My apologies. Your actions will lead you through a riveting story that changes based on the you know decisions you make. You know what would be riveting? Make. Skipping this the part end, of the direction. Where will your conviction guide you? <laughs> you have gone to the one place I cannot follow. In response to the I haven't even finished Bravely to Fall. <laughs> this year, the game has been fine-tuned with a focus on elements that received lots of feedback. I don't know. Maybe it's good. Adjustments to the difficulty. Improvements to on-screen visuals. Bravely Default has been Camera very good. Controls. I just haven't finished it. The ability to review previous dialogue. And streamlined game flow and loading times. I'll show up for every month. No, I'm, I'm excited for the now Monster available stuff. on Nintendo.com. Splendid. Triangle Splendid. Strategy will launch on Nintendo Switch March 4th, 2022. Oh, Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. This was Square Enix, right? Probably. Also not winter. I thought we were just dropping the letter D and moving on. Which I would have been into. You are faced with overwhelming power. Your highest priority <laughs> should be simply to survive. This game looks rad. I don't know if I'll play it though. It looks cool though. I'll maybe watch somebody play it, but it, it looks really, really cool. <laughs> Thanks for letting me know. Small opportunity to escape. Don't let your Chat, I don't wanna I don't wanna spoil anything. But Samus is a <laughs> Samus is a girl, chat. I don't know if you knew that. But now you do. <laughs> I'll never recover. <laughs> Spoilers, but like what? <laughs> Spoilers for like a 20... 25 year old series the most powerful bounty hunter in the galaxy embarks on a new mission to the uncharted planet Her objectives confirm whether the deadly X parasite still exists and figure out why the Emmy research robots in search of it have mysteriously gone dark Early readings reveal that planet ZDR is divided into multiple environments. Man, this game looks good. Each with its own elements. Who is Samus? That's Metroid's friend. Yeah, Metroid's on screen right now. 
It's like in Zelda games, you play as Zelda. The Chozo and you gotta save the princess. His name is Link. Including evidence that the Chozo may have once called the planet their home. Visit metroid.nintendo.com to read Metroid Dread Report <laughs> Volume 8 for a detailed account of the terrain. I don't know why. The voice reading a URL was really funny to me. Metroid Dread game. Be sure to view the other Metroid Dread Go to www.metroid.com the slash dread slash Launches on Nintendo October Switch, 8. October 8. Pre-orders <laughs> are available now on Nintendo eShop. How was that? Up next, we have news about Nintendo Switch Online. Oh, cool. You're fixing it? Many people have been using Nintendo Switch Online since it launched in September 2018. In addition to the current membership, we'll be adding a new membership plan. A new plan? As a part of this new plan's content. That's how they're getting in chat. You want to play this game for the 18th time? <laughs> You'll be able to play a collection of Nintendo 64 games. Can I play Stadium? The Nintendo 64 system launched 25 years ago. I think this system gave many players their first 3D gaming experiences. Ooh, Pokemon Snap, yeah. As well as intense. That's the worst Mario Kart. I don't want to hear it. That Mario Kart is awful. With it's Nintendo the worst Switch, one. Up to four people can play select Nintendo 64 games locally or online. Also, with this new membership plan, in addition to the Nintendo 64 games. <laughs> Excuse me? Man, I had a Genesis and my mom sold it for like $25 at a garage sale. Sega's Genesis system. <laughs> this means you'll be able to play these classic games whenever and wherever you'd like. I still don't know how Echo the, the Dolphin will works. include all elements of the base Nintendo Switch online membership. As well as the ability to play the included Nintendo 64 and Genesis games. It just has the Genesis behind the camera. This is Nintendo Switch Online plus Expansion Pack. Nintendo. This new membership plan will be added in late October. <laughs> Nobody knows how it works. Of course, you'll still be able to continue using the existing plans. Wait, do you have to pay more money to do the Nintendo 64 games? Also, those who have an existing membership plan can change over to the new plan. Yeah, see how much money is it? Show me the plan. We'll share more details about this it's new more membership money. plan at a later time. You want to play Ocarina Time? The exact release date next and pricing. Five dollars a year. For now, however, we'd like to announce the games that will be available when it launches. You'll be able to play the Nintendo 64 game shown here. Is there literally a single person? Oh, well Ristar was Genesis so games. good! Also, Golden Axe was sweet. We'll also continue uh, adding also more Echo Nintendo pretty 64 cool. games, such as The Legend of Zelda, Majora's Mask, and F-Zero X. Oh, that F-Zero well game is good. Nintendo 64 and Genesis games oh, going snap. forward. I'm holding my breath for more Pokemon games. Just Furthermore, now. we've prepared Nintendo 64 and Genesis controllers to ensure the games can be played with the same style controls from their original releases. Wait, they're releasing a new 64 controller? <laughs> Both can be used wirelessly. <laughs> I kind of want to get that. These controllers 50 will be available bucks? for purchase. Nintendo, by any Nintendo, are you Switch out of your mind? <laughs> You want me to pay a yearly membership and fifty dollars? Nintendo Switch Online plus expansion pack. Are you guys insane? Let's see a few more Nintendo Switch headlines. I don't like Pokemon Snap that much. There's plenty to play in these collections. I get a used Nintendo 64 for fifty bucks. That's actually probably not true. Cyberpunk meets fantasy in this three-game collection of cult classic RPGs. As a Shadowrunner mercenary, you'll explore a Yeah, that controller is awful. <laughs> <has reawakened laughs> Why would we pay a premium come back for one life. of the worst controllers ever made? Immersive branching narratives, skill-based character growth, and gripping turn-based tactical combat await in Shadowrun Trilogy. Hey, what's up, Ollie? Launching on Nintendo Switch. OG Snap is pretty cool. Except you remember that it's like a 45-minute game. The perpetual struggle against Count Dracula continues. Castlevania Advance Collection brings together four classic Castlevania games with deathly beautiful graphics and hauntingly epic music. I played one Castlevania. I liked it. Quick save 
and button mapping features will also vamp up or ramp up your fight against evil. Oh, did you see what All he said? Vamp because vampires game, chat. I had as well as a gallery joke. mode with never before seen artwork are included. Oh, Castlevania Advance Collection launches on Nintendo Switch later today. An almighty classic returns. Yeah, they're awful. <laughs> Whoa, what is this? Look at this tree texture. The classic Super NES game Act Razor returns on Nintendo Act? Switch. I don't remember now this. Now remastered Act in Razor? HD. As the this Lord like of Light and Almighty God, only you can save mankind from the forces of Tanzra, the Lord of Dark. You'll wage war in two phases. First, strike down monsters in the side-scrolling action phase to liberate the lands from the grasp of evil. Master swordsmanship and magic to vanquish all who stand in your path. Then, they said it'll be a new plan, fab, but they didn't say the, the world price. Building creation phase. It's up to you to decide which structures will be destroyed to make way for new ones, creating a flourishing civilization. As you do so, your powers will increase, giving you an edge in both phases. Alternate between the original and rearranged versions of the beloved soundtrack <laughs> and enjoy brand Fair new music. Freedom. New stages and new boss battles also await. They know what audience they're pandering to. Act Razor Renaissance descends onto Nintendo Switch later today. A new chapter is about to unfold. Uh, I played Undertale. I never played the whatever. I, I thought it was all right. I enjoyed it. I mean, this looks like more Undertale. No, I don't own any tank tops, Ollie. Doesn't Undertale have like the worst community though? Can I just wait till the whole thing is done? Is chapter two the end? Isn't that any fandom? <laughs> it's not, I'm gonna wait to the end. I'm not gonna play one or two until it's done. How's everything? There are still a few more announcements in today's How is Nintendo everything? Direct. You said that you're focusing on winter oh, games and you've shown two. What brings you in? I wanted to make an announcement, so I was hoping I could step in. Oh, of course. Gosh, how old is he? Hi everyone, I'm Shigeru Miyamoto. We've previously announced that I have been working with the Hollywood movie studio He's like, well, like 70 and now? its CEO and producer, Chris Melodandri-san, who are known for movies like Despicable Me and Sync He's in making 30. a full-length animated <laughs> Mario movie for the big screen. Today, I wanted to announce its theatrical release timing. Ta-da! The movie will be released in theaters He's in holiday 2022. The release date for North America is on December 21st and will be announcing release dates for Japan, they did Europe, say winter, and other but regions at a later missed time. The memo and it's It'll be a while longer until we can share a glimpse of Mario in action on the big screen. But today, I also wanted to reveal our key cast members who will be voicing Mario and his friends in the movie. Well, chat, I'm sorry I didn't tell you earlier. First, of course, but... is Mario, who will be Excuse played me? by Chris Pratt. Uh, He's so cool. What? Mario will be talking a lot in the movie. <laughs> Excuse me. Hold on. Mario as performer. <laughs> I was not expecting this. Chris -san. <laughs> Next, Princess Peach will be played by Anya Taylor Joy. I don't know who this is. I can't wait to see a very spirited Princess Peach. Mario's little brother Luigi will be played by Charlie Day. Queen's Gambit. Oh, I'm I've seen two episodes of that. Okay. Timid sibling appear on screen. Charlie Day is from. Always. Bowser will be played by the one and only Jack Black. I'm expecting a monster performance by Jackson. The comedian Keegan I can't keep Michael up with Keegan this. <laughs> There's a lot happening. I'm looking forward to great comedic moments. <laughs> I don't know who this is either. <laughs> Even though this is a Mario movie, Donkey Kong will also what be is happening? one of the characters. What is he will happening? Be by Seth Rogen. <laughs> I'm eager for you to see a humorous Donkey Kong by Seth's son. <laughs> And of course, Charles Martinet, who has voiced Mario and many more Nintendo characters in our games over the years, this. is also involved. 
and will be appearing in surprise cameos in the movie. <laughs> we also have more incredible talent joining the film to play some of our What's other beloved Kamek? characters. What's a Kamek? Oh, that's the it's the thing with the wand. That is all I can share with you today about the Mario movie. This is a very collaborative project between Illumination and Nintendo. We've all been coming up with all sorts of ideas, and I myself am enjoying a creative process that is a little who, bit okay, different. Okay, who is from Luigi? Wait, where is it that may dude be a from? While until we can share more updates, but I hope you'll look forward to it. Koizumi san, back to you. Always Sunny. Okay, that's what I was going to say. I was like, I, isn't he from Always Sunny? Jumping into the world of motion that's like pictures. the best thing he's ever done, right? Next, we'd like to show you this. He was in Pacific Rim? Really? Pacific Rim was a good movie. F-Zero? <laughs> well, I was wrong on that one. <laughs> Splatoon is my favorite MOBA. <laughs> is it a MOBA? No, it could be though. If they added more objectives, it could be. like their adventure mode you know what mode was really good in splatoon 2 that like um gears of war mode they had i can't remember what it was called but you were in like the swamp yeah salmon run yeah salmon run was sweet that was probably the best part of splatoon 2 i hope they bring that back in some form Yeah, Splatoon has a good aesthetic. I can't believe they're already on Splatoon 3. <laughs> like, to me, Splatoon doesn't feel that old, and they're already on a third version. We got six minutes left? Hello, everyone. I'm a researcher from the Squid Research Lab. I've been meticulously studying the mysterious squids that can transform into humanoid form. What you just saw was the latest research footage from Splatoon 3. Allow me to share a bit of what we know so far. Splatoon 3 takes place in Splatsville. It's known as the city of <laughs> chaos. Centered around Splatsville are the Splatlands, a place long inhabited by advanced Man, sea you know so much good such style. as squids and octopuses. Buildings spanning several generations are crammed into the city, creating its distinctive culture. In the Splatlands, turf war appears to be a popular activity. Its basic rules are unchanged. Two four-player teams compete against each other was five. to take the most area. I guess that makes sense. However, the trend seems to have undergone a major shift, with the existence of new main and special weapons confirmed in the footage. In the latter portion of the footage, we were able to observe activities from Story Mode, the single-player campaign. Return of the Mammalians. The Mammalian. The reappearance of mammals appears to be the theme of story mode what? this time around. Did I miss something? I never did the story what of Splatoon 2, I just played the outline stuff. In a stuff. world where all mammals, except for two cats, have vanished. It appears that there's still a lot to uncover. There was a story? <laughs> yeah, there was like a whole story in Splatoon 2. <laughs> but we'll continue with our research and keep you updated once more results become available. Please look forward to more. Splatoon 3. Yeah, are they are they gonna end with Pokemon? Updates to come. See you next time.
So, what did you think? Splatoon 3, taking place in a new also world, not winter. is scheduled to release in 2022. Please look forward to future updates. Okay, this is the last trailer we have to show you today. Please take a look. That's going to be like Fire Emblem. Oh, this, is, this seems worse than Fire Emblem. What is this? <laughs> A Shiba Nunu. This is Call of Duty. Nintendo. None of this is Pokemon. Was that Zygarde? This seems bad. None of this is Winter. <laughs> Oh boy, something dramatic has to happen to convince me that this game is worth watching. They, they saved this for a while. <laughs> There has to be some twist, like Mario pops out of him, right? Is this the twist? Oh, is this Astral Chain? I forgot that game existed. Oh, it's Bayonetta. I still don't care, but at least I know what it is now. Unfashionably late, but I'm ready to give you everything you want. I think these games are really cool. I just don't like playing them. The like action slashy RPG ish games, like Devil May Cry. They're like really, really cool to watch, but. Like I'll watch somebody play it, but I don't, I can't do the like combo things. PVC, <laughs> jeez. I mean, you're not wrong. Yeah, people really like the Bayonetta series. There's like three Splatoon games in between Bayonetta 2 and 3. Also not winter. <laughs> that was his cloud. What you just saw was the latest trailer for Bayonetta 3. Is Bayonetta still rated M We for announced this game in 2017, and we thank you for your patience. This game will launch next year. We hope you look forward to Bayonetta's new encounters. It is, yeah, it was, yeah for the first two were M. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. February is still winter. Thank you for yeah, well, okay, if it was February, they would have said February. I actually am really shocked there was no Pokemon. Spe okay, so the reason the joke was, the joke was they said, 
featuring roughly 40 minutes of games focusing to launch this winter. It literally says it right here. That's why we were like, everything they showed was not this winter. <laughs> what? <laughs> like, I guess like an Animal Crossing update and like that salt game.